The first step towards achieving your dreams is having the right coach. Get the best education with Hybrid Trader and make your options, strategies and swing trading dreams come true. Download the app now. Good evening all. Am I audible guys? Can someone please confirm? Can someone please type yes? If I'm audible. Okay, great, great. So I think uh, today's session is going to be like rapid fire question, right? So I'll be not even focusing anything on the uh, chat section. Okay, so it's all about we are going to see like almost like 10 to 15 different types of adjustments. So there is no scope for Q&A. Okay, because, uh, okay, uh, what I'll be doing is like, I'll be just explaining you with my real trade and then uh, maybe last 10 minutes I'll open up with the q &A. And guys, just to give a disclaimer, right, uh, this session is for both uh, by paid mentorship and also for the free. So this is not uh, a dedicated session for only for the paid membership, but in general, I'm just having this session, including the non-paid mentorship also. Okay, just a disclaimer. <clears throat> Okay, so we have decent participants. So anyways, I'm going to put this into the uh, YouTube also. Okay, uh, let me uh, let me share my screen. Just let me know if you guys are able to see my screen. Okay. Uh, okay. All right. <clears throat> you are able to see my screen, right? Okay. All right. See, <clears throat> see now this session is going to be like very rapid fire okay so do not uh on on switch on your comparison mode right only for next 30 minutes or 40 minutes or for one hour i just try to focus on the content what i am telling and then later after the session you can come up with your own thought process whether it was right or wrong okay for now for time being you have to just focus on the content and today i'll prove you why the adjustments are so dynamic Right. Even in my paid mentorship program, few guys ask me like, what is the adjustment? So that's what, right? Adjustments are dynamic. Adjustments are not static. I cannot tell you one adjustment. Adjustment A works for people A, but the same adjustment A doesn't work for people B. Right. End of the day, what happens is like the, the view uh, matters, the, uh, the risk appetite, right? The trading style, <clears throat> your own trading style based on the VIX, based on the uh, MTM, what MTM do you have profit or loss? Right? There are like so many permutations and combinations. That's the reason I keep on telling you adjustments are not dynamic. But today I'll show you many, like five, not five, 10 to 15 adjustments basically. So which would open up your eye and you will believe me, yes, adjustments can be dynamic. One adjustment uh, can be one of the favorite for like 10 people. This is the same adjustments those other 10 people will not like because because at the end of the day, what matters is like, what type of a trader are you? Are you an aggressive trader or a conservative trader or are you a gambler? Right? We know, right? I mean, no two persons' opinion uh, are uh, equal, right? Even if I ask you what is the view of the market uh, within the available participants, 30% will say up, 40% will say down, remaining will say sideways. <coughs> Okay, so this, this, these are the different thought process all the retailers will be uh, having, and it's it's very difficult for someone, right? Uh, uh, even even for anyone to tell you the adjustment. So, guys, believe me, be it my paid or, or non-paid members, guys, you have to come up with your own adjustments. I'll be showing you all the adjustments on fly, but end of the day, you should not ask the adjustments. You have to get that done on your own. Okay, so let me straight away start with the adjustments, right? So this is my original trade buys right i think uh let me show you let me take you back to uh, my youtube channel okay right <clears throat> see if you look at my youtube channel this is what i've done okay see 20 percent in just two days with the position and already i've made one more video saying that how how to how the naked option buying can be converted to position see this doesn't have anything to do with the strategy what i meant to say is like this is my original trade this is the debit spread and i have like three to four trades adjustments i'll be showing you but i've started with this the debit spread with the naked buying and then i've converted the moment i got 20 percent i've converted it to uh, a sort of uh, debit spread right? same thing now let me take you to this trade so this is going to be like quick rapid fire so are you guys all set can someone please say yes to me are you all set? I'm not. I'm. I'm not even going to look at the Q and A, guys. Honestly, I'm telling. You, I'm not even going to. Uh, your screen is not visible, is it, guys? My screen is not visible. 
visible right yeah <coughs> can others confirm please yeah visible okay so maybe whoever has said right i mean can you please rejoin the session okay see now what i'll do is like <coughs> forget about the strategy forget about the trade whether it is debit spread or credit spread so what i want to say is like basically i've started with okay let me take the epic pen that, that would help see basically i've started with the <coughs> one second okay see basically i've started with a, a naked buy position okay and you all know already i've made the video a naked buy position the moment i got with a good profit i've just converted it to a debit spread okay what is a debit spread on top of buy position if i have sold one thing so this is my debit spread we all know that now now my maximum profit see if i could have if i could have booked my profit of 3000 right so i i could not have uh, increased my profit to 6000 so what i've done is like the moment i've deployed the naked buy okay and then i've converted to to a debit spread so now i am able to increase my profit okay my maximum profit is 5500 keep a check on this thing and my maximum loss is 666 that's it i can i can i can i can hold this trade with peace of mind but now we will be discussing about the adjustments let me make it very quickly <clears throat> okay now what i'll do see first adjustment is like just it it all depends on the view based it all depends on the view based now i'll show you <clears throat> first what i'll do i'll exit this for 45000 right 4500 <clears throat> okay i'll exit this okay now the moment i've exited this so now this is this is the only open position what i have right 58 rupees is it now if someone has the view of dr reddy might be uh, sideways might be range bound so what you can do is like you can just convert this to strangle we we have already discussed so how to convert this to strangle so we have 58 rupees premium the sole position call to convert it to strangle what i'll do is like i'll take you to i'll go to uh, add edit i'll just try to sell <coughs> maybe one put that's it so now this is your typical strangle now what happened is yes your your uh, capital will increase along with that your absolute profit will also increase let me read and un uncheck this thing. initially your capital was 25000 okay but still you add the profit of uh, almost like 18% but the profit you will be getting this 18% profit only when the market goes up if it comes down you will end up into loss okay now the moment i've converted this to strangle now it's a two way right it's a two way yes your profit has increased now you should not be asking me question what if if this happens that happens i am going to show you all the adjustments on a rapid fire okay now <clears throat> this is you you have a safety of almost like uh, 4% downside 4% upside so we have another 10 days for the expiry your profit has increased but just in case if someone says that uh, dr reddy uh, this 4% is not a good range this can break so what you have to do is like simple guys what you have to do is like let me uh, clear this trade so what you have to do is like <coughs> exit both this trade okay you have to exit this leg and also what was that this leg that's it so you have exited now you have your profit so now what you have to do is like simple go and deploy a strangle right people people get confused with this that's it you exit your existing trade and convert this to strangle now you your profit is less but you get a, a range of almost like 4.32% or downside 4.12% if someone is not comfortable right you what you have to do is like 100 points uh, sorry one strike up below one strike above now check your profit has decreased but your range has increased right now you have a safety of 5% on the downside 5% on the upside yes your your capital will also increase so i'm just telling you if your view is bullish don't even come into strangle if your view is sideways go for strangle conversion if you're still okay uh, saying that i don't want 8% of the profit i'm okay to get 2% of the profit that's it what you have to do is like go 1% up 1% down now your profit has reduced but your range has increased right almost 6% downside 6% upside okay so this is the way if you're not comfortable right so forget about dr reddy guy forget about dr reddy it can be your index it can be anything dr reddy i'm just taking as an example <clears throat> because that's a trade what i have with me and and believe me stay with me till the end i'll i'm going to show you all the adjustments i have like another two to three trades okay now this is a strangle conversion now again i'll delete this okay you have you, you have seen like how to convert this to strangle <clears throat> now i'll reset now again i'm back to my uh, debit spread now
what other people might have done is like yeah let's see uh, let's see uh one second let me show you right uh if you are if you if your view is bullish i would i would rather say don't do any any of the adjustments that's it because if your view is bullish you will be getting 18% profit on a capital of 25000 i'm just showing you 25000 you guys you can go for multiple lots don't look at this absolute profit check the check the percentage okay what is uh, 3200 on a capital of 24000 okay it already shows 10% right if you look at this thing this is 10% don't look at the absolute profit just because i'm playing with only one lot that doesn't make sense uh, in terms of checking this okay this strategy is if i would have played with 10 lots it the profit would have been 31590 if i would have played with 100 lots the profit would have been 3 lakhs uh, 3 lakhs 15000 now what i'll do <coughs> now what i'll do okay so just in case if someone is bullish about the trade just leave it but if someone if someone says that okay market can retrace okay let me take you to my uh, chat okay this is very important guys okay i'll show you everything with right so this is my doctor ready okay so i might have taken the trade when the price was here okay now it went up so i know there is a, there is a critical resistance based on my price action based on my price action there is a critical resistance because if you look at this white color line whenever the price went it resisted whenever the point uh, price went it came down whenever the price went up it came down it went up it came down even the price is standing here so let's see my view is maybe still i'm bullish in uh, dr reddy but it might retrace so what i'll do in that case what i'll do <coughs> okay see stay focused guys okay now what i'll do i'll i'll go to this thing okay uh my strikes are 45000 is a buy and 45500 so what i'll do uh, what i'll do uh okay let me uh i'll exit this okay and then maybe i'll buy this and i'll exit this and i'll sell this okay or else let me show one second guys <coughs> give me a second guys give me a second see what i am planning to dislike let's say uh, <coughs> 45000 right 45500 okay what i'll do i'll exit this so if i want to exit i have to buy back okay now let me see if i what if if i sell this right see the moment what i am trying to do is like what did i say this is a view based this is the second thing first what we have discussed is the like strangle conversion right strangle is if the market is sideways the second thing what we did is like do not do any adjustments do not do any adjustments if your view is bullish so i have targeted the audience whose view is sideways in terms of showing you in the triangle now this is whoever as the view of bullish don't do any adjustments try to capture this 18% now if someone like people like me have the uh, view of the market saying that dr reddy can retrace from here right I i want to double out my profit so what i'll do i'll just see what i've done basically what i've done i have exited this one sold position 45500 see 45500 to exit this i have to buy back and then i went like 50 or under strike and i sold a new so now check if the market falls if the doctor reddy takes a retracement of just like 1.2% you will be getting with uh, almost like 6900 uh, profit right still still you will be getting with 440 profit but your view changed here okay your view is dr reddy will retrace i'm showing you for those guys whose view is like retracement or a sort of reversal you all know okay now what i'll do i'll just try to increase this loan okay this would not work because we do not have the much spread difference right even if this is fine right anyways if your view is bearish or a retracement if you are confident right let's say you have a bad news in dr reddy i'm just taking dr reddy as an example guys again i'm telling i'm taking a dr reddy as an example it can be a nifty it can be bank nifty let's say there is a bad news or a result or sort of this thing where where you are clear that the stock might go down but still if you do this what was your original profit guys your original profit was 5500 but now yes your absolute profit has increased almost to two times right almost to two times but your loss is only 1379 so what are you doing here right you are just giving a loss of 1379 but you have doubled up your profit yes obviously if you look at this thing your 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 capital will not increase guys that's the beauty your capital has not even increased let me reset this 
right your capital was 24000 now what you are doing is like you have just converted it to uh, a sort of credit uh, spread right uh, what do we in the money credit spread and now by just giving the loss of 1379 you were able to double up your capital if you are not comfortable giving this loss also what you have to do is one second let me show you Right, that's it. <clears throat> this is the only one thing you. So maximum you will have minimum you will have four forty profit. Maximum you will have six thousand seven hundred profit in case if the if the stock makes a retracement or reversal. Right? Are you clear, guys, so far? And there are like many other adjustments. What I'll be discussing with you, right? This is the way. So I've targeted three types of audience. So what happens in my paid mentorship program is like people ask me about the adjustment. Why? This is what I wanted to come. You have to tell me your view. What is the view basically? Without you telling me the view of the market, I how can I suggest you the adjustment? <laughs> how can I suggest you the market? You your view is important, right? And tell me one thing. i am doing all this adjustment just because my trade is in profit guys if your trade is not even profit then how can you increase your maximum profit 2x times 3x times like people will ask me again right i want to increase the profit guys try to understand only when your trade is in green you can increase your profit that's it when your when your trade is in loss mtm loss you have to think in terms of mitigating your loss right not in terms of increasing the profit if you are if you are planning to increase the profit when you have the mtm loss then you have the gambler mindset now again i'm telling right i've started with the naked buy i've converted this to uh, a sort of uh, what do we say uh, debit spread and then now what i've done right my view has changed on the dr reddy i thought maybe dr reddy will retrace so then i've shown you you can increase the profit but just in case if you want to if you want to sacrifice right let me show you right your profit is 6 7000 here just in case if you want to double out almost like double you have to sacrifice this 1379 rupees <coughs> and we all know right how to mitigate this loss or just in case if the doctor rate is going up also we all know how to mitigate the loss end of the day you have to collect that extra credit okay now i'll again raise it now what again i bought i got it to the base state so we have seen like four adjustments one is for the bullish one is for the uh, sideways and now one for the retracement and reversal now just in case if you do not have the view of the market yes your trade is in green but you do not have the view of the market what you can do simple guys what is this debit spread now just convert this to credit spread sorry see convert this to butterfly what is butterfly basically butterfly is a combination of one debit spread and one credit spread so what are we doing here this is already you have the debit spread so i am just i am just deploying a credit spread so what i'll do i'll go for 45000 what is this 4550 i'll i'll sell one and then i'll buy this that's it now this is for someone who doesn't have the view of the market yeah still i can say slightly bullish but now minimum you will get 1271 profit uh you calculate what is it 1000 on a 43000 capital minimum and maximum you have the potential of 7521 better than your debit spread your debit spread has only 5500 the moment you have converted it to a typical butterfly your profit has increased but there is a catch okay your debit spread you have you do not have any upper circuit right anywhere if the price expires between this Uh, upper range your sole position right what is your sole position 45 500 till upside you will be getting your maximum profit but the moment we convert this to butterfly right your maximum profit would be only when the price expires in between the triangle guys i'll be like making it very quick uh, if you if you want to know you can watch this video i'll be like uploading them into the uh, youtube also you can watch once twice now <clears throat> if someone is not comfortable with this thing right uh, i'm okay with the debit spread because i'll be getting my profit only when the market expires here between your triangle which is which you should be like fortunate you should have that luck and everything right what you can do is like uh, let me clear this what you can do is like 45500 right so what if if i go for maybe 46 and then see even this could be one of the adjustment base see there are like so many adjustments even this could be if you say i am like sideways right dr reddy can retrace <coughs> or 
it can it can go up also even if it retrace you'll be getting like 4600 so almost like uh, 4500 profit on a capital of 1 lakh which is almost like 4% and even if the doctor ready expires within this green zone you will be getting a profit of almost like 9% even this could be one of the adjustment okay let me uh, let me take this to uh, right a uh, 4550 so what am i making already i have like 4550 position i am selling one more 4450 position this is your typical 1s to 2 risk to reward or oh, sorry you know 1s to 2 uh, ratio right your profit is 6000 if the if the doctor ready goes down even if it makes a lower circuit and even you have a question of almost like yeah your blue line is steep see i cannot tell you any magical formula right you but in the live okay let me see what dikshita has to say but in the live market all the prices will be different so pay off graph will be see see uh, dikshita i'm doing this post market right you'll not have uh, what do we say so much of difference yes live see that's what right i mean i have done this trade in the live market from the debit spread i've converted to the credit spread uh, what do we say uh, from naked buy to debit spread yes there could be some difference in terms of Minus five because tomorrow when market opens, yes, you have to do that based on the current price. But I'm just showing you the template. Okay, I'm not showing you in the obstra. I'm showing you my live trade, right? I'm showing you my live trade now. <clears throat> right now, this is one is to two is to the point. Okay, now what I'll do? Uh, let me buy back this. Right, we we have seen this is the uh, butterfly. What will I do now? What if if I increase this thing and if I increase this thing? See now, this is a sort of ladder. okay if someone is not comfortable with the butterfly see what is what is ladder basically we are trying to create a surface here we have not done anything magical the, the what we have done is like i have the sole position of 4550 rather than selling 4550 what i have done is like just i have sold 40 what is it 4650 so now i have a flat surface right i have a bigger range yes my loss is 640 uh, sorry my minimum profit is 646 my maximum profit is this thing right this is one of the sort so now if you increase this to one and increase this to that's it now you will have a minimum loss of 116 rupees here but you have made it almost like a ladder you have a bigger surface so just in case if the, if you have the uh, view of the doctor red is going to it can be bullish you can do this right and now let me increase it <clears throat> if someone says that uh what do we say the doctor red is can be like sideways to bullish you can change like this see there are like so many adjustments guys i mean i cannot tell you each and every adjustments it all depends on your it all depends on your view of the market your thought process okay so we have seen this also okay so guys did you understand so far these are all the basic adjustments what we are discussing we have seen like five to six Four to five adjustment. This is what you have to do. So that's what I'm telling Dikshita. That's a valid question, but forget about those things. See, obviously, right in the real market, you will be seeing the fluctuation in the premium based on the VIX. But I, I am showing you my real trade. Insensible. I'm not showing you the obstra. Okay. So far, even I got confused. Like what all adjustments uh, uh, I have to show you, right? So we have discussed about the butterfly, how to increase the profit. Okay. Now, now comes the beauty. Guys. See now, now again I. got back to the default state now what you have to do is like go to this ready made trades okay this is your trade right this is your original trade go to this ready made trade right you have to do this sort of experiment so what if if i deploy a call ratio spread that's it just try and try to deploy a call ratio spread <clears throat> Okay. See now, check the beauty, guys. See, I'm not sure like whether you will be able to understand this or not. On top of my debit spread, what I've done is like I've just deployed a call ratio spread. What is that? A uh, call ratio back spread. This is not call ratio. This is a back spread. Okay. Now let me show you. I'll deselect this thing. What happens when tomorrow market opens one percent gap up? So your profit would be three thousand four one six. Okay, your profit would be three thousand. Uh, see, one second. Let me show you. What if I were your profit would be? If you look at the black color box, tomorrow when Doctor Reddy gaps up by one percent, your profit would be a three four one six. All right. Now what I'll do? I'll I'm deploying a call ratio spread. Now let me see what will happen if the bank need, if if this makes a one percent. See now, on top of debit spread, if you're deploying a call back ratio spread. the so same 1% move will give you 4550 more than your uh, 
your, your plain vanilla debit spin. If someone wants to take the advantage of right the the upside movement, right, you can go for this trade. I'm not suggesting you, right? This is just I'm showing you multiple ways of how you can do the uh, adjustments. I'm not recommending you, but just imagine like two percent. Let's say tomorrow, right? Three uh, percent. Let's say three percent. You will be getting nine thousand one seventy two profit, right? It it happens with the stock, right? It it might not happen with the Nifty or Bank Nifty, but usually the the uh, stocks like Doctor Reddy or <clears throat> Reliance, right? Three percent, four percent, five percent gap ups are very common, right? Even gap downs are common, gap ups are common. So let's say tomorrow market opens like three percent. Gap up, you will be getting a profit of almost nine thousand one seventy two. But if I have not converted this to BRS and this is my plain vanilla debit spread, so three percent profit will give you how much of profit? Right, only four thousand four thirty eight. Okay, this is the way you have to think. So now you tell me, are the adjustments static? Now, if someone asks me what adjustment I have to do, so this is where. I get into that pain basically. How should I let you know? This is what we discussed in my paid mentorship program, guys. Adjustments are ocean in itself. It all depends on your thought process, your trading style, your risk appetite. We have seen like five to six adjustments. I can discuss with ten to fifteen also. Now, <clears throat> now let me let me raise it. <clears throat> I said this is going to be a rapid fire. Now let me take you to uh, bearish and let me deploy a put back ratio spread. What will happen? That's it. This is how I do. Now, the on top of my debit spread, I've deployed, I've deployed a put back ratio spread. Simple guys. Now check your profit. Your profit shows unlimited. Unlimited will be only when you have the huge gap down. But you still have six thousand profit. If the if the doctor ready keeps going up, you will be still having your six percent. Uh, what is it? Six thousand profit. On a capital of forty-four thousand. Now you decide. This is also view based, right? If someone says this is a tricky one, right? If someone says Doctor Reddy's can go up, then why am I why am I changing this to BRS, right? I can go for this thing also. But what happens, right? Check this. Check it here, right? Your profit has increased six thousand. Also, if the if the Doctor Reddy gives a gap down, you will still get into profit now. Now, if you if you are not if you do not want this profit, so you have to change the strikes. <clears throat> See, now two thousand five hundred. But even now, this is a very good position, right? Even if Bank Nifty makes sorry, not Bank Nifty, Doctor Reddy tomorrow makes a gap down of let's say two percent. Even you are you are getting five thousand six hundred profit on the capital. <laughs> guys, give, guys, give give me a second. Give me a second. One is at my door. Okay, sorry guys, uh, my dog Sherry, you know right, super active guy. <clears throat> okay, now see this. What happens with this thing, guys? Again, I'm telling you this. Okay, let me again tell you. I'm not sure like whether how many non-paid programmers are sorry, not program non-paid members are there because all my paid uh, members will easily understand. They will be able to correlate this BRS. But maybe if if it's not new for someone. Guys, anyways, I'm going to upload this video in the YouTube. You can watch once, twice. Okay. So what am I doing on the top of debit spread? I'm deploying a uh, put back ratio spread. Now, if it goes up, if the doctor radius goes up, yes, minimum I'll have two thousand five hundred profit. Still, that's a very good profit on a capital of forty eight thousand. But worst case, what if the doctor radius makes a two percent gap down? Still, you will be getting profit. Now, do not ask me what 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 if if market stays here. I I know, I know. Even I used to ask that question, but now I'm not asking any such question. There is no holy grail in the market. I cannot tell you all the adjustments, but still I'm telling you all the adjustments with all the view, with the sideways, with the super bearish, with the sideways to mild bearish, sideways to mild bearish, super bearish, right? All the condition. Now you have to decide. Okay, so even this will give you profit in the in the. Uh, Gap down and also gap up. Also, you will get with minimum two thousand five ninety. Now, it all depends on your trading side. If you want to adapt to this strategy, it's good. I think this stands good, right? You have profit on the upside and you have profit on the downside also. But just in case if it stays static, right? You have to think about other contract trades. So basically, we are discussing about all the contract trades here. Okay. Now, what I'll do, so guys, so far you're with me.
<clears throat> because I have like too many adjustments to to show you. That's the reason I'm making it very rapid fire. You can watch this video. I'll, I'll upload. Okay, good. Okay, now what I'll do? I'll I'll clear this thing. Now I'll go to neutral. Okay, now I'll see like what should I deploy, or I'll go to so now I'll try to deploy call ratio spread. That's it, guys. Call ratio spread. <clears throat> Let me see now. So check the magic, guys. The moment you have deployed the call ratio spread on top of your debit spread, even this is sort of view based. Your loss is only one thousand ninety eight. Right? If someone has the view of uh, Doctor Reddy or any stock, right? It can be like sideways to mild bearish, or you can call it a super bearish. The moment you have done it, right? Yes, your capital will increase, and your absolute profit has also increased. Your loss has also. It's it's only one thousand three hundred. So now you have to decide. If 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 you if you do not want to give the loss, you have to play with the uh, strike selection. See the moment what I have done is like this was your original. If you are not comfortable giving a loss, let's say Doctor Reddy can also go down. Just change it. That's it. Now you will get your minimum like two thousand seven two thousand seven hundred profit on when the Doctor Reddy makes a uh, what do we say the the down circuit downside with still the potential of thirteen percent and. And Dikshita has asked me that question, right, guys? That that concern would be there for sure, right? See, I could have done all these adjustments during the market hours at three thirty, right? I'll be getting the same premiums, right? Maybe if someone is thinking that this guy is showing post office post uh, market hours, so maybe I might be getting that premium or not. Just to answer Dikshita's question, right? Yes, I could have done this adjustments even today at three o'clock or three thirty. See what difference I'll be having? Only like point two percent. Right? Just try to understand. I'm not showing you the obstra. I'm not showing you any obstra. I'm not taking you any simulation. I'm showing you my real trade. I could have got all this premium at three twenty or three o'clock. Okay. Now this is view based. If let's say Doctor Reddy, you have the view of sideways, right? Even if it goes sideways, you will get two thousand seven seven hundred. Still, that is like almost like two point five percent on your capital deployed with a profit of thirteen percent. You got my point. Still, I would say, still I would say, two percent, two point, uh, what do we say? Like almost like three percent, I believe, right? Two, two, two thousand seven hundred on a capital of nine hundred. I'm getting three percent profit, even if the doctor Reddy's makes a downside moment with a potential profit of almost like thirteen percent. But now you have to think. It all depends on your view base. Okay. Now, okay. What I'll do again if I if I go like one strike above. Right. You you are back with this thing. If you go like one strike uh, above. Right, you have only two thousand. If you want, you can go for forty-four thousand six fifty. Also, right, this has increased almost six thousand profit on a capital of one lakh twenty-eight thousand. If the doctor Reddy's goes up, you have the cushion of almost like how much? You have a cushion of almost like three percent. Yes, your blue line is steep. Uh, the moment the market falls here, you will be get, you will be getting into loss, but still you have the cushion. So it's view-based adjustments. At least, can someone please answer me saying that adjust, when I say adjustments are dynamic? I mean, did you get to know at least? Did you get to know? Can I can I say you any one adjustment? We have discussed like seven to eight to nine adjustments. I try to believe, guys. Of that, that's what I mean. See, for me, for me, out of seven adjustments, I I, I can take a poll, right? Let's let's take a poll. I mean, let let me take a poll, right? I I'm I can ensure that it will be like ten percent, twenty percent, maybe adjustment number one. Thirty percent will like adjustment number two. Twenty percent will like adjustment number three. Thirty-five percent will like. So that's the reason it's very difficult for me to tell you the adjustment. So that that's the reason we discussed in our paid program. Right, you have to come up with your own adjustment. I can show you another twenty adjustments also. So this is the way you have to play with sensible or obstra. And believe me, guys, I'm not promoting sensible obstra. Uh, it's a pain basically you get because sensible it's a matter of only clicking that's a reason i use sensible i do not have any interest towards sensible yes i am associated with sensible i get some commission but i use obstra for simulation but for execution i use sensible it's a matter of only one click for me to go for the basket orders okay it all depend let me get you back to original <clears throat> so now it's up to you if your view is sideways to bullish you go for this now i'll again Exit this now. What I'll do? I'll go for put back ratio spread again. I'm back to my debit spread. I'll go for put back ratio spread. That's it. Now check the beauty, guys. This this is what I want. Now, did anyone thought about this thing? Now, what did we say? This is the best adjustments what we can do for the debit spread. 
even if the market goes up still you will get 5000 profit on a capital of 1 lakh 2000 so what is it i think uh, it's like 3% if i'm not wrong minimum 3% profit but still if the if the doctor really comes down you have the potential of 8% right profit so now you have created if someone doesn't want to give this loss also you have to play with the uh, this thing your strike so from this was my original strike 45 so from 45 i got it back to 45 50 that's it so now you have converted it to 1s22 so what is that basically so you have two sold positions so basically three right two plus 1 3 and then you have only two buy position this is almost like 1s22 risk uh, uh, ratio spread right if you go below right right this is what now even this is if you're still super bullish about dr reddy but still have the concern of maybe it might go sideways also go for this thing you have 7500 profit on a capital of 123000 okay you can play with sell your sell position also see if someone says that dr reddy cannot be sideways either it can go up or either it can come down just go for it why you are concerned about this loss right this loss is 1348 and even if you think like if you want more range go something like this still you have like 3600 profit which is like 3% and uh, this is almost like if 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 your view is either super bullish or super bearish go for this thing. still you have 14% profit okay so likewise what i wanted you to do is like the reason why i'm telling you to go for this ready made trade is like basically that will give you a new thought process you cannot imagine so do you imagine guys i mean let let me reset can you just imagine right on top of my debit spread what will happen if i deploy a ratio spread can someone please tell me can someone please tell me unless and until you try with this ready made do some do some weird things right just go and play with the sensible and then you will get up with some good thoughts some good ideas <clears throat> Did did anyone thought the moment I deploy a ratio spread, my trade will become something like this, right? Right? It will give it will give me a profit on upside. I mean, because I've I've made the changes like this. Okay, let me get it back to uh, this position, right? Check this. Unless and until you do it on your own, you will not get into uh, those thought process actually. So this is what I keep on doing. and this will be possible only when you do with single lot now many people question me this guy does only with single lot but i'll show you my profit with this with the larger quantities i'm not ready to play with the large quantity is yes. now i started playing with two lots three lots four lots five. i'll show you like other trades also this is only for the debit spread right i do not i do not care about other space see uh, i am telling you my genuine genuinity actually right only when you are playing with single lot you will be able to play with the that's what i call i am into experimental phase i am into experimental phase i do not look at the profit i want to do more of experiments right in in last 30 minutes we have discussed about 10 to 15 i can discuss 100 adjustments also but is that required no we need hardly two to three adjustments what is see my view cannot be 10 views right we have discussed about uh, five to six views so can can my view be five to six guys no right but if my view says sideways to bullish i'll just go for one that the whatever adjustment i want i'll go for i'll not think about all these things but whenever the view changes i need to have the strategies that's the reason we discuss this thing i mean one disclaimer to all the non paid and also the paid guys this this is the pain which i have whenever i want to tell you the adjustments rather what i want is like you guys do this adjustments and let me know so that i can correct you Okay, now what what i'll do is like <clears throat> okay now what i'll do uh, let me clear do we have another trades okay so let me see what happens if i go for some iron fly let me see okay on top of my debit spread this is what happens with when you go for iron fly right i do not know now if if you are okay with this thing you can go for it right you you have a good uh, profit 3000 this thing and loss if if at all you want to uh, what do we say make the loss uh, low on the this thing also what you can do what you can do is like you can just increase that's it <clears throat> now minimum 1000 see on top of debit spread you have deployed a iron flag i have never thought this i never thought this but still if you are okay with this thing if you say that dr reddy can be like uh, sideways you will still get 11% profit minimum is 1000 like 2% profit is minimum now right if someone if someone asks view you can just play right if you are like sideways to super bullish go for this why why should you uh, think about this call side then 
right as and when you do so if you are like super bearish go for this thing still you will get like 4000 on a capital of 52000 if someone is bullish then why will you right go so go do something like this right do something like this still you have a cushion of some decent uh, area but if you are like super bullish this is what you'll get 4500 on a capital of 51000 okay so see i can discuss like 10 15 right i i, I literally wanted to uh, have this session so that uh, see uh, okay okay let me so now what i'll do is like i think we have discussed too many things uh, in the debit spread see there is no end for the adjustments now what you have to do is like go deploy one trade and try to use this ready made what will happen let me see like what will happen if i develop if i uh, deploy a short strangle simple this is how this strangle will behave but this is not a good thought right this is not a, because strangle anyways it's a naked strategy so i will not convert this to strangle because i have loss on my put side rather what i would do is like rather what i would do my uh, the initial strangle what i have shown you right just exit this entire what what do i see exit this and you can just enter with this strangle 14 rupees and 14 rupees so this is my decent strangle even even if i have this all the trades this is a sort of strangle <clears throat> right now do do you think right you have a good safety now right almost like 4% right almost like 5% safety on the downside and almost like 7% safety on the upside so let me show you one more thing now just now it clicked in my mind so now <clears throat> just tell me one thing what see now my loss is 666 okay my loss is 666 let's see let's say i am bullish over dr reddy but i have some concern saying that even this will go down so what i'll try to do is just try this so this is your testing side your call side is now testing and this is your opposite side now what i'll do i'll try to collect 14 rupees premium from call that's it check the beauty now right you have a see initially your trade was giving you 6 700 loss on the downside the moment you have captured 14 rupees the moment you sold a put for uh, 14 rupees See, check the beauty guys right you have 7340 profit on a capital of 97000 which is almost like 7% still you have the uh, breathing space a cushion of almost like 4% 4% check check this like 4.76% right even if market expires here you will still get with 1090 which will be for your brokerage and for your uh, other expenses but your main trade is this one so if the view goes right you will get with good profit even if your view comes down you will get with the, i mean uh, with the progress now what i'll try to do what i'll try to i'll try to sell maybe like 14 rupees from the call side also that's it check the beauty now you will get 2 3000 profit right on a capital of 1 lakh 17000 so what am i trying to do here i'm just trying to add the credit still you have the good potential of getting this profit almost like 70% profit if it goes up even if it comes down you have the safety of almost like 5% downside still you will get the profit of 2878 which is almost like 2.5% on your capital now it's up to you i've just told you if you want to increase the quantity if someone is like very aggressive i know i know uh, we have one guy do we have yogesh here by the way sorry yogesh i'm taking your name but i get to know i get to learn many things from yogesh i mean he plays with a very huge capital yeah yogesh yeah yogesh for the right i mean today we have discussed about one of the strategy wherein uh, yogesh was playing with huge capital uh, right i mean i i love doing the case studies right yogesh can easily beat this trade yogesh i mean how does this look for you i think 5% downside and 6% i think you will be able to manage this but for me it might be difficult because i play with only single lot yes i can carry the moment let's say this is like 50 lots yogesh was playing with 50 lots today right i mean that that's the learning yeah, yeah that's what right 5% safety on the downside and uh, almost 7% on the upside so we are not leaving this trade as it is right we will be doing some some of the other adjustments if i deselect this thing again you are back to your debit spread okay so just try to think in terms of collecting this premiums from testing side and also from the opposite side do not follow the same traditional uh, adjustments wherein you are uh, whenever the market is at your call side you tend to buy only or you tend you tend to sell only from the opposite side by try to sell from the testing side also 
So for this, you need the price action. Let's say if this is a critical support, let's say if there is a critical support somewhere here, right? If this is a critical resistance, sorry, let's say this is a critical resistance. So go two to 300 strikes above and try to sell huge calls. When you know that this is a very critical support and you're taking a cushion of 300 strikes above when you're selling, the beauty is like you will get more premiums. If that particular strike becomes a, a, a OTM, you will get more DK, right? And you will, you, I mean, whenever the market falls, right? We all know whenever the market goes up, right? We all know the VIX. See, I mean, already we discussed all this thing in the paid mentorship program. If I start discussing, that will take a huge time. So guys, are you with me so far? Are you with me so far? Now, let me see. This is, uh, I've shown you like, many adjustments i can show you like 20 to 30 adjustments right just watch this video one time two times three times and then you have to do the uh this thing so now let me take you to my other trick what is my other trick guys what is my other trick okay <clears throat> typical reliance okay typical reliance even i've started with a naked buy check the beauty i've started with a naked buy i believe and then i've converted it to a sort of butterfly what is my loss now Right, my loss is only 1262. My profit is this thing. So now, can you guys please tell me what all adjustments I can do? Right. Again, this would be like repetitive. I do not, I don't mind whether this is a debit spread or a credit spreads or a what what I mean, is this reliance or is it nifty? Is it bank nifty? For me, this trade matters. What you have to do is like now you think, guys. Now you think, how can I right manage this trade? I would rather leave it as it is because end of the day, it's almost like one is to one is to eight or one is to nine. Either I'm okay to lose this 1,200. What I want, I want Reliance to expire within this green zone. That's it. Even if it goes to the down circuit, even if it goes upper circuit, what am I going to lose? Only 2.1%. But still, am I going to give that loss? No. I'll try to do some contract rates and everything. Okay. So now let me show you what will happen if I deploy. Let me show you, right? I'll not, I, I do not even know. Let me deploy a call ratio spread. What will happen if I deploy call ratio spread, right? This would not work. Okay. This would not work. This looks ugly. What will happen if I deploy a put back ratio spread, right? This, uh, this looks something interesting. Now, do not look at this loss area. Now, if you are bearish about Reliance, right? If Reliance gives a gap down of let's say 3% right which which is reliance can give you panic can give you gap up of 5% 8% 10% up, upside and downside to either way you are safe call side is yes, you have profit your maximum loss is only 3000 this thing and if it gives a downside so this is what i keep doing let me go to bullish and let me try to deploy a call back ratio spread right it's up to you if you feel that reliance can go up right even a 2% move is giving you a profit of almost like 6,536. Okay, let me deselect this. Your original, this thing, 2% move, right? Tomorrow, how much it is giving? 2% move is giving you only 1,946. I'm talking about T plus zero. The moment you deploy this, 2% <coughs> move is giving you how much? Almost three times more than the profit. But I'm not recommending you to go for this trade, guys. I'm not giving you any recommendations or tips. I'm just sharing you my ideas and you have to do that. Important thing is to have a view. See, without view of the market, don't even uh, think about uh, making your career in trading. I know many people will ignore <clears throat> the price action. It's up to you whether you're using indicators or so-called uh, uh, your typical price action or if you're, see, basically you have to do the price action on your own. Okay, let me show you. Uh, I'll Let me show you one more example. Let me go for uh, put back ratio. That already we have discussed. This is the way you have to do. Let me again one, show me one thing. What will happen if I deploy iron fly? See, have you ever thought the moment you are deploying an iron fly, yes, your loss is only 2,766. Your loss is 2,000 on the, on the upside, but still you have the 9% potential profit. And this is a very good. Now you have to manage it like an iron fly. Let me show you a straddle, right? This is a straddle. I mean, I mean, I, I can't even think about this two-sided unlimited loss, right? Let me go for strangle, right? This is how. So now, if, if you have the view, like just add some edges here just to make this undefined loss to define. What will happen if I go for short iron condor? 
right this is this is the payoff right and there are like so many jet lizard just try to click yeah. see if you click if you try to click on all these things right you see this is a very good strategy check this guys you are deploying a batman on top of your iron on top of your butterfly it looks perfect right looks balanced like 4% downside and almost like a uh, 5% upside it's up it's based on your view okay now let me take you to one more trade <clears throat> these are all my real trades guys yeah usd ayana this i want to spend some time down check this usd ayana i've not even done a single adjustments when i've deployed i was okay to take a loss of 1630 which is 2% on my capital deployed with a with the profit of almost 15% see what i want is like 16th december so i have almost like one and a half day today is 14th what i am expecting is like usd inr should just make 0.30 dollar downside move if it expires here i'll be getting 15% profit if it expires here i'll be getting 6000 profit if it expires here i'll be getting 3000 uh, 500 if it expires here i'll be getting 870 if it expires, you you know right so now the reason why i've not done any adjustment is like a uh, one and a half d right so now the adjustment what uh, i i can do is like simple guys this is your butterfly can someone please tell me what is the best adjustment for usd inr at least from my paid uh, group <coughs> guys what can i do with my uh, how to make this profit <coughs> can someone please let me know from my at least from my paid group what could be the ideal right broken wing fly strangle right strangle okay let me see right let me go and deploy see uh, if i want to convert this to strangle let me see right what i have to do is like i have to exit this two things right 82 and 82.5 okay 82 and 82.5 okay let me make it to 50 what's the time by the way my goodness okay only 50 minutes right i thought it, it went for 2 hours okay 50 okay now check see now what i'll do uh, i'll sell <coughs> uh, call we sell this hundred now <coughs> check this so you have a safety see now your absolute profit has increased right still 5% within one week out what i've done what i've done is like basically i've exited this buy i've exited this buy and then i have this sole position open what i've done is like i have the pe right so whatever so what i've done is like i've just to convert this to strangle i sold a put that's it now you still have like 5% uh, you have a downside of uh, almost like 5.5% dollar move 0.5% upside dollar move now it all depends if you do not want let's say your view says that 0.5% you can easily break yes nowadays usd inr has also become uh, very crazy basically right uh, yogesh bhai right <laughs> even even i've seen basically usd inr is also giving a movement of 0.46 0.67 within a day ideally that was not the case with the usd inr right something fishy is happening in the market but end of the day end of the day uh, end of the day see at least we can trust the usd inr because end of the day it's a currency between india and uh, us okay so at least we can trust but nowadays it has become volatile but still for one and for one day for one day I am okay for 0.5 percent dollar downside and upside. That's it. Now let me reselect. Now I want dollar to come down. Then only I'll be getting with this profit. But if I would, if I have a chance to make it sideways, either 0.5 percent down or 0.5 percent up, I'll get this absolute profit. So who are are okay with this 0.5 percent for one and a half day? Can someone please type me yes? Are you okay with this thing or you feel this is a risky trade? USD INR. at least you guys at least ari says yes again i'll show you if someone is not comfortable with this thing what you what you have to do is like exit this entire trade okay let me show you right uh, see what you can do is like let me deselect and even today guys even today also you will you will get with good premium so let me say if i go for this uh, okay one second uh, sell Where is that? One second. <clears throat> okay. Let me take. Even today we were getting very good premiums actually for only one day. Let me take you to the USD Ayana. 
and clear position go to 16th december and let me sell this to okay now okay let me sell this who all are okay for this guys still 2.7% profit okay let me make this 100 then only you will be able to get okay still 2.7% within one day with a safety of 0.7 down 0.7 upside what do you say still i add this but i did not add the capital because i need to maintain some capital because i'm playing with low capital 8 lakhs right so i have like multiple trades guys that's the reason i could not but still i'm getting 2.7% within one and a half day with a safety of 0.7% the guys do not ignore the usd inr see i'll tell you one thing i intentionally trade this uh, i intentionally trade this guys okay where am i why it is not showing any mistake i have done why the trade is trade is not getting shown any idea okay anyways right we are done with this this thing but check this right you are still getting 2.7% if you want more safety simple guys you have to go roll up and roll down but check the premiums now even i'm okay with 1.6% on a capital of 260000 i am getting a range of 1 dollar and 1 dollar i mean guys if someone has the fear of trading this thing also you are not a trader <coughs> simple 1% downside and 1% upside with 1.6% in just one and a half day do you think within one and a half day this will make a one side upside or downside check the probability probability says 87% but i would say at least i would say 100% at least in one and a half day we cannot expect it to go to 1 dollar okay now what i'll do so we have discussed about usd inr also see there are like many uh, uh, what do we say adjustments you can just give it a try what is this yeah one this is my all time favorite see uh, guys can i can i move to the other trade i'll i'll open up the q and a i'll open up the q and a for sure but just stay with me now what i have done i have today morning i went into a uh, put debit plain vanilla put debit spread guys that's it check the check the risk to reward so i'm almost getting 1 is to almost like 3 3.5 now the beauty of the put debit spread is we, you will get some good premiums on the put side and check the check the break even now check the break even so so even if uh, what is this your nifty makes 1.13% expire somewhere here i'll be getting 25% on my debit spread 25% because i'm just playing with three lots intentionally i have deployed i do not have any logic at all somehow i thought maybe looking at the chart i thought maybe nifty might retrace forget about reversal if it is a reversal i'll get with this profit within a day let's see tomorrow if if, if uh, nifty makes 3% downside move that's it i got i'll get i'll be getting 14000 on a capital of 64000 now you calculate what is it profit this is the beauty of the put debit because when the market falls the vix rise i want to take the advantage of the rising vix okay and check the check the loss i mean any on any given day within my contra trade that's what we discuss within my paid program see i, I mean i i have already deployed the contra trade but if i start showing it to my all my paid members they'll get confused basically that's the reason i'm sharing all my trades the contra logic in the telegram channel so that you 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 get to learn i mean you learn from me rather than uh, trading with me okay now uh this uh this is the plain vanilla debit spread i have 20 seconds so i know i do not wait for tomorrow's expiry right i might have deployed this on thursday also on tuesday also that sets it i i add the capital i went with this so now i pretty well know how to how to mitigate this loss not 5 not 5000 at least i'll make it to 2000 2500 I, i have the attitude of accepting this stop loss okay now do we have uh, do we have krishnan iyer uh, but there is no additional profit left now which one is yogesh which one additional profit but there is no additional profit left now what do, what do you mean to say additional profit okay i'll i'll come back to you okay we'll take that now do we have krishnan iyer uh, okay uh, now this is the last trade guys right this is the last trade okay 
this is the last trade so basically i've deployed a pe calendar spread in bank nifty right what is my loss my loss is only 2188 and when is this 22nd so i have another uh, how many days i have guys right 14th right so 29th is the 22nd is expiry so i have like 1 2 3 4 5 6 If I'm not wrong, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, six working days. Six working days. My only bet is <coughs> forget about the strategy. My only bet is like VIX has to increase. If VIX doesn't increase, I'll end up losing this two thousand one eighty eight. If VIX increase, let me show you. Right? Maybe there are like new folks. I believe I'll show you. Right? What I want is like just keep a check on this profit and this loss. Seven thousand is a profit. Two thousand one eighty eight. Let me show you by VIX by increasing to five points. Not VIX, basically the IV. Okay, every time I keep on telling VIX five. That's it. Now the moment the VIX has increased, the the price is static. There is no movement at all in the price. Check the profit. Your profit has increased from seven thousand to ten thousand, but your loss is still the same. So the moment the reason why I have deployed the put. Uh, for the basic the calendar spread is just to take the advantage of rising vix now if i add this minus 5 what will happen my loss will be only 2188 so now my bet is only to take the rising now someone has asked me one question in my paid mentation what is the adjustment for this thing again let me get you back to zero correct what is the adjustment so basically i'll not do any adjustment if i want to do the adjustments what i'll do what is my loss maximum loss Okay, two thousand. Right, there is a calculator. Knowingly, unknowingly, my system got upgraded. Okay, I'm not sure what what is this operating system. Like, can someone please tell me? Looking at this view, is it like Windows eleven, twelve? I don't know. I mean, overnight it got changed, so I'm, I'm having some difficulty. Okay, now this divided by twenty five. So now I have to just capture eighty seven rupees credit. That's it. So now I'll use all the contract rate logic in terms of mitigating this loss. That's it. So there is no adjustments. This is not at all a strategy. People call this as a strategy, right? This is not at all a strategy. I'm just trying to take the advantage of rising VIX. So what I'm expecting is like next seven days the VIX should increase because VIX is at low. Let me show you. <clears throat> Where is VIX, by the way? Right, India VIX. Okay, it is at almost like it came almost to like eleven. So I want the rising VIX. That's it, guys. And no other. I mean, I mean, I do not do the any adjustments. So now, if it is going against my view, either I'll deploy uh, a contract rate. My my responsibility is just to cover that eighty seven rupees. Either a good profit or make your loss zero. If it if it if it makes a good profit, so you'll be getting nineteen percent up to nineteen percent profit based on where the trade stays. And if the VIX increase, your profit will also increase. If I increase it to five points, right? VIX is very low, guys. Some day, one day, VIX has to go up. That is this. It can be tomorrow. It can be day after tomorrow. This week, next week. But try to deploy more of these trades either weekly or monthly. Accept the loss. Accept the loss, and again next week, again you deploy one more uh, put uh, uh, calendar spreads, right? Your loss will be like five hundred, six hundred, but the moment it gives you the profit, you will get with huge profit like this. So maybe I would not mind giving a loss of five hundred rupees one time, right? Two times, three times, and then I will be capturing this ten thousand profit. That's my strategy. So fifteen hundred is my loss. And then ten thousand. That's it. So I'll be like, this is what you have to plan. So try to take the advantage of rising VIX. And if someone asks the question, if I want to take the advantage of rising VIX, why do I need this sell position? Why do I need this sell position? Yes, you can go for naked option buying also, because whenever the VIX increase, let me show you. Right, let me show you. I will not still recommend you to go for this thing. Right, let me delete this. If this is a naked buy position, guys, let me show you. If this is a naked buy position, let's say market has given you two percent downside moment. Check your profit. Your profit is almost twelve thousand, right? Why? Why the market has fallen? The the premiums have increased. The buying premiums will increase your premiums now. With two percent, what is your profit now? Two percent. 
the next day profit would be only 2743 so now it's your call if you are confident that the wicks will go high or the market will come down see there are like deadly combinations right i'm just telling you right uh, then go for naked buy if someone wants to take the advantage of rising wicks why do i need this sell why not i take so that's a reason i started deploying the naked put buy as a contra trade see everything i do contra guys guys i'll take one minute still we have some decent participant right if someone wants to join my uh, paid course right guys just go to my website and you can just text me right if you want you can just text me about the uh, upcoming uh, what do we say uh, the upcoming uh, session so I'm, i'm most tentatively planning to start with the second batch from first jan but i think ideally first jan would be not uh, this thing but at least try to send me a message do not call me because i'm not a full time trader but definitely i'll respond to you i'll i'll call you back if you are interested still i got like 20 to 30 inquiries so uh, if you are interested please text me sorry guys i've taken some time so now let me take you back again to <coughs> right that's it guys i think since from last i thought of 30 minutes but we have discussed almost like 1 hour 6 minutes how was the session guys and i'm doing it with all my real trades i'm not showing you on obstra believe me i'm showing you yes premium difference would be there but not huge because i'm doing today right even at 3 o'clock or 3:10 3:20 i would have got all the premiums <coughs> how was the session guys now you have to watch this video at least two to three times especially someone is very good at uh, all my this thing so it is not required for you to watch uh, one more but someone is like new or if you want to know what all adjustments if you want some time to digest what adjust i can show you another 20 also but that is not required right that is not required now you have to play on your own you have to have your hands on experience i mean every time i see sentil uh, i mean sentil did you copy paste something or what the same number of claps you will give 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 can't you give like 10 12 15 i think you might have copy pasted <laughs> okay guys anyone i mean do we have out of the participant anyone who is uh, who is non uh, paid member of my first group at least is there someone can someone say s yes if you are not part of my batch one or do we have all the batch one folks i am not at least uh, ready uh, venkatesh at least i will be soon great at least okay any other guys i mean okay i uh, got it guys at least i mean this session i have basically done for you guys <clears throat> because i'll tell you one thing i think i got like 15 to 20 whatsapp messages saying for my batch two right uh, i think i think out of 20 i have 20 to 25 i've shared with everyone guys the today's meeting session so that you'll get some clarity basically before going for my batch right you you will get some clarity so what what you will be learning and whatever we are discussing this is only like 5% 10% and believe me you'll get more of such learnings if you believe right because i do not want to uh, uh, what do we say right give you false commitment we are i'm not going to give you any tips guys five point number one even i'm not giving tips in my batch one because i'm not a sebi registered user right uh, if someone catches right i mean i'll be sharing my own trades you give your trade i'll be i'll be analyzing the trade i'll be telling you what adjustments you can do no tips no recommendations seriously i'm telling you because i wanted you to become an independent trader so today i've shown you like 10 to 15 to 20 adjustments now you have to think on your own all right so guys okay now what i'll do so there is there is even if i open it for the q and a right i think uh, again my paid members will ask about the videos that and this so do you want me to open uh, what do we say the q and a or should we wind it off the session guys it's up to you if you want to open i'll just uh, unmute everyone q and a i think johnson sir i think i think i have to mute johnson sir i think johnson sir <laughs> i know the question of johnson sir again <laughs> So Johnson sir, this is this is not the paid. So any any yeah okay, I'll unmute you everyone. But guys, this is not the paid, right? This is the open. So just keep that in mind, and maybe you guys can ask all those questions. So now let me unmute for ten minutes, everyone. Okay, mute and allow participants to. Okay, yes, guys, <clears throat> you can mute. But at least people who are not talking, let please mute yourself. Okay, uh, you yeah. can ask the question. Good evening, uh, uh, Ravi. Yeah, Johnson, yeah, Johnson. Johnson here. Yes, uh, 
just two things first of all i would like to thank you for sharing your trade in time okay i have taken some initiative and your response is very good and very encouraging and the participants also most of them are actually uh, using it okay to what extent i don't know but it is very useful coming back to one doubt on your uh, the present one what is there on the screen right now mm -hmm. that is uh, instead of this uh, one is to one suppose you go for one is to two i think that would be slightly better especially when you go for you know a scale up uh, version yeah yeah we can we can the the thing is like see this matters sir honest to jordan sir this matters that's it whenever you go for one is to two this matters the vega the more the vega the more you will get with the profit when the wicks rise but it has the it has the dwell impact also i mean what do we say right the impact also because when you are make let's say you you go with two lots so this might become 350 so now 100% your wick should increase from there if it decrease so then your loss will also increase based on the strike selection so all about whenever you are you are increasing your buy quantity that has direct impact with your vega but believe me if you go with two lots and the wicks is increasing your profit will increase like anything but it will it will have the adverse effect if the wicks keeps falling because yeah but uh, ravi just to to add i'm, I'm not count, uh, countering but your point is right but only my uh, feedback for <coughs> last uh, three weeks i have been taking this with uh, 20 quantity 20 lots 500 each <coughs> and uh, even when, when i took the uh, trade three weeks back the wicks was 3.3 32 mm -hmm. oh, sorry 13.32 right now thinking that you know as you said uh, it is slow and it is likely to go up to at least 14 but Absolutely. the trend is actually downward now Absolutely. in spite of actually going down i could somehow you know uh, come out with the profit there is no much uh, uh, difficulty even if this uh, you know wicks is not going up or it's slightly coming down still you can come out of uh, profit that is what my first feedback on this and Good. secondly just to counter your argument that wix is likely to go up i don't know whether wix is uh, maybe wix will uh, stay here for some more time i don't know we cannot see yeah that's what I mean. this this entire zone is only for directional trade but wix is not shooting up that's a, that's the reason so that, that's the reason of stop uh, going for the calendar now and the, one more point uh, to add one more point to be you know another next two weeks especially last two weeks of any year you know mm -hmm. the fii's and other players will not be very active by which you know the market will be almost uh, lackluster so mm -hmm. uh, in that scenario since we are taking this one for a weekly one i think it is uh, i don't know my uh, i think my view is that it may, it will not big may not go up because the volatility will come down i'll tell you sir so why not you deploy this trade I am taking right. this trade. I, tomorrow I will take this trade. Same, yeah, same one day accordingly. Yeah. yeah, don't go for don't go for call. I would see that's a recommendation. Don't no, go for only call. put only put, put on yeah. both, but quantity is more. Yeah, and try to try to mitigate your loss. So what did I say? Try to take less loss, less loss, and when the wicks uh, takes. And now we all know there is a budget, right? What's the date for budget? Do we have the typical uh, February budget? February end, you know. Uh, I think February end, right? Maybe maybe uh, maybe see now when the wicks is down. so not expecting wix to go up by jan 31st something right maybe i might be wrong right it cannot be something like wix will go up and then again it will fall again see usually what happens is like so we have to take the budget also into consideration so i'll what i'll try to do is like johnson said as you said right i'm going to deploy this put debit spread every week sorry put credit spread every week but i'll yes. ensure that see intentionally i've given this more loss yes you can give less loss also you can make it zero loss also But yeah, that is what you achieve by putting one is to two equal, almost equal. Yeah, got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The moment you put two, I think your loss will reduce here. But that's what uh, we wanted to do. Okay, guys. Any other questions? Okay, thank you, Ravi. Thank you, sir. Especially the new folks, right? I mean, someone want to share your experience. Good, bad, right? Adjustments are dynamic. I mean, you, you maybe uh, do we have uh, uh, the candidate who asked about the premium, right? What's her name? Her or he? I'm not sure. Dikshita something or anyone. Anyone not part of my batch one? If you have any questions, we have another ten minutes, guys. Anyways, I'll be uploading this video onto the YouTube. You can watch multiple times, if at all you feel worth. <coughs> if if there are no questions, Johnson sir will start again. 
<laughs> you want me to add i don't that's what i'm telling that's what i'm, I'm ready, so, I'm ready. So, so i've given you the counter sir at least next 20 seconds if no one asks me yeah. a question ravi definitely presentation Yeah, right. yeah. yeah. So, so I, I am not part of this, uh, uh, you know, uh, the group. Okay. Uh, but, but I would like to do that. But, uh, you know, my experience in in uh, using these strategies is 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 minimal, right? Or I would mm-hmm. say I am beginner to minimal, minimal kind of thing. Mm-hmm. Uh, but I, I, I'm I'm really excited because I have seen your videos. Okay. okay, and uh, and that's where you know I I and and the most interesting part was. you know uh, you have stressed more on how to save the capital right so right. so that's that's why because every uh, traders nightmare is that you know their capital erodes very fast right? and right. before they could re- realize you know and i have been doing you know trading naked so uh, so now this hedging uh, is really something which uh, i would like to uh, learn so how do you think you know uh, your program or, or this thing could help me because uh, i haven't seen the you know curriculum or anything yeah yeah so when get just to make your job easier right? so what so maybe within a day or two i'm just trying to come up with a small video sorry guys all the paid mentorship just try to bear with me uh, so i'm just trying to come up with a small short video i'm just trying to come up with like two plans two different plans okay i'll make a very short video so that all your questions will get clarified Okay, that 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 uh, I'm just working on it. So within a day or two, most probably by this Saturday, that video will be ready uh, on my website. I'll just make a video, and just you guys can just go through those videos, and then you will uh, get to know uh, all about the details. Okay, okay. and this is this is for everyone, right? Whoever is joining uh, for the first time, this is for everyone, right? I'll I'll be making a video like short three four minutes video, which would give you like complete details about the training. right plan I'm, i'm 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 trying to come up with like two different variations okay so based on that you can check it so guys can we give it a call right can oh, we only one doubt uh, wonder ravi sorry yes, sorry for that yes, just a reminder uh, yes. you know sometime back uh, uh, you told that you would be cons- taking this uh, jade lizard uh, application point of view mm-hmm. uh, maybe can you cover that also maybe sometime later yeah yeah jade, jade lizard yeah we can cover that. that's yes. a very short Because, uh, once yeah. yeah i It's think sort of uh, ratio spread uh, entrance you know that sort of thing no it, yeah, you are converting the, to sort of ratio spread right that plays very good in the uh, fn stocks yeah, yeah but the application like, point of view <laughs> when to enter when to enter you know you don't know probably you know you start with the strangle mm-hmm. and uh, you think that okay market will go up and down then market goes up uh, my my only doubt is when to Enter into that, you know, additional buy point. Okay, okay. Problem is, so, you know, you you think that okay, our market will come up, okay, it will come down any time, any time, but you don't know the momentum is there or not. Yeah. So when so to I, enter that additional buy is my doubt. I had yeah. seen your video. I am talking, yeah. referring to that only. Yeah. This is this is all about I would say the momentum. Okay. Anyways, we'll discuss that. See, we have another like four to five weekend. I think six weekend sessions. I believe. right we can just leverage those times for all the qna sessions yeah momentum i'm just giving you a summary sir this is momentum let's say if something went like 10% or 15% that's the that's the main thing what we have to capture so we will discuss that johnson sir right right thank so you. guys can we close the session <laughs> since from i don't know i'll i'll get some some or the other health issues i believe continuously I talk uh, if any any question i'll be like happy to answer the people are not having mood because of the game i think waiting for the match to start Which game, sir? See seriously, which game? Football, football, no semi-final. Second semi-final. Oh, see, honestly, I'm telling, I love football, but I don't know. Somehow, I don't. I, I stop following the news. Also, I think, yeah. I think, I need to get. I some think time. you are so, fully dedicated for this. No, not this thing. Actually, I'm not a full-time red. So usually, uh, until nine o'clock, I have back-to-back calls. So what? So yeah. can someone? I, I can. Yeah, we can imagine. Who are those so many two activities. semi-finalists? Who are those two? Two semi-finalists? Four semi-finalists? Can someone? <laughs> the only three were now already have gone to final no oh so we we have the match now sir now uh, maybe it's all of 12:30 it will start 12:30 oh okay then all right so i'll be like uploading this video into youtube and also put into the uh, g drive and one uh, uh, the take away for all the paid members is like there are like three to four simulations pending from my side on my signature strategies guys please go and watch the twin brother strategy johnson sir you have to watch the twin brother strategy don't I ask me any questions all your st- all your videos at least yeah, uh, that is times. that is one of the masterpiece what i can see that's it you have to watch one time two time three times and then 
that would act as a masterpiece honestly i'm telling and one Chilo more thing that to you today is your mm-hmm. pace was correct for me you covered so many things very fast you know it was very easy for me otherwise it was little difficult okay okay <laughs> it is okay yeah. because <laughs> yeah pace was i mean that's what right i wanted to discuss like i could have discussed another but let's see like i mean maybe, maybe as and when i get some real see discussing on the real time uh, real trade will give you more uh, what do we say like uh, idea basically rather than we doing it to the simulation simulation right everyone knows right i know the view of the market right yeah, i yeah. might react to the view of the market but but discussing the real trades i think that's the crux i don't know whether market can go up or down or sideways and everything guys chalo guys i think i thought of having only for 30 minutes but it went to one and a half one and a half hour okay anyways i'll be sharing you all this uh, we will have webinar on saturday time. right next uh, yeah yeah saturday and sunday also we will plan okay okay time will inform later yeah uh, saturday i think we'll have it at 6 o'clock only or or, or, okay. or else i'll take the code yeah in between 6 and uh, 8 anything right right thank you thank all you all right chalo thank you folks yeah thank you guys